Starting from this lesson, we'll deal with the second scenario, setting margins between parent and child tag. Usually the parent tag will always be a block tag, but its child tag can be anyone, block, inline or inline block. As usual, we'll discuss the three scenarios separately. First, we'll start with the block child tags. First, let's try horizontal margin. We assign the margin left property to the child tag. And we can see that it's working fine. The child div has been pushed rightward. The location of the parent tag is unaffected. Next, let's try vertical margin. The result is quite shocking. The margin top property was assigned to the child tag, but for certain mysterious reasons, it's worked on the parent tag. The relative position between the parent and child tag stayed the same, but the parent tag was pushed downward. If we had a grandparent tag here, the result will be the same. The margin top property worked on the grandparent tag. If you add margin top to the parent tag and child tag simultaneously, only the bigger margin will take the effect. The smaller one will be ignored. Before learning how to get around this bug, let's check if the bug also exists with inline and inline block child tags. Inline tags don't work with a vertical margin. Therefore, we only need to try the inline block tag here. This time we were lucky. The bug didn't show up. Therefore, the margin top bug only exists with block child tags. If we convert the img tag into block, the bug will return. So solving this bug is rather simple. All you need to do is separate the top border of the child and parent tag. You can set a padding or border to the parent div. Just one pixel will be enough. If there's no contact, there's no bug.